Thank you very much, Britain. Today has been a whirlwind for one San Angelo police chief candidate. Sergeant Travis Griffith held a press conference earlier today addressing an email that his wife sent to her co-workers at a San Angelo elementary school. The email encouraged everyone to vote, listed polling information, as well as contact info for Griffith and no other candidates. The issue with this, it was sent from her official school email. In efforts to set the record straight, Sergeant Griffith joined me here in studio this afternoon for an exclusive interview where he balanced his role as police chief candidate with that of a husband. Take a look. Sergeant, thanks for coming in. Yeah, thanks for having me. Appreciate absolutely, you. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. So uh, earlier this week, an email went out from your wife to members of her school community, and there has been some traction about this story. Could you kind of tell from your perspective, from your wife's perspective, what happened? Her intent is what she told me. Her intent was, was merely to, to get the information out to the people, but obviously whenever you're married to someone that you care about and you love, that uh, there's going to be things in there that, that, um, that 100 percent in hindsight shouldn't have been there and she made a mistake she just definitely wasn't thinking about uh, any type of uh, wrongdoing she had no intent uh, what she was trying to do was just uh, support her husband. How is your wife handling this? It's been super, super hard on her. Yeah, so we have a brand new baby boy. Uh, he's four months old, and so we're navigating all the things to include campaign and a brand new baby. And we have a 19-year-old daughter, so the whole family is really feeling this because, I mean, you know, we're, we're, she's being accused of this, you know, terrible thing. And really, what it is is she's out there sending an email in support of her husband, and 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 you know, we're going to let uh, the review that the school district's doing play its course and we're going to respect whatever that is. I just That's why we came out with the press conference today is because, I mean, at the end of the day, we're going to be open and real. That's what I run on, being transparent. That, and my wife, she said, that's, that's what you need to do. You, you, you said this, and that's what you need to do in this case, just like would be any other case. And we're going to walk through this and respect the rule of law and respect the process and know that that's what you'd get from me as your police chief. Any words to voters now that we're just a couple of weeks out about you, your family, what yeah. the city means to you? I think at the end of the day, nothing's changed about Travis Griffith. If anything else, you know more about me to know that I'm going to stand up and be transparent. Um, and, and my wife is going to continue to push me to do that because uh, we're not going to get caught up in the middle of this. And, and this will be the last that we're kind of addressing it is because we're getting out there to say what's really important is the voters. What's really important say the voters, the citizens, right? Regardless of whether you should even turn out to vote, San Angelo has an opportunity to, to be different and, and make a way and, and, and lead in public safety and lead in the areas of, of accountability and transparency. And I tell you, without the Lord in the middle of this, um, I would be completely a disarray. And I'm trusting him and I know that he's got a plan that's gonna take us through.